We are recording. So, click back into the game. Dark Souls 2 Definitive Edition. Uh, gonna be doing the... Uh... Abyssal Lord? Is that the name of it? It's one of the expansion campaign. This is the tale thus far. The Lord of the Black Stone yep. has vanished. His smile a promise. There is more to come. Will you find the strength to restore the Third Kingdom? Or is it your brothers who will emerge? Demon Lord Belial. Interesting that, because I know I saved it after I changed the campaign before. Anyway. I certainly didn't get started. Yeah, and do have some notes. Mainly just three things. Um, there was plenty of news this week, but it, it still mainly was three things. Let, let me... sure what game it is, but there's some game that you dodge on alt, and it's just making hit halt to try to dodge time. That's why I kept locking onto people temporarily. God endures. Though the White City is forbidden to us, we yet serve the light. These are the days of reckoning. We shall not falter. And we are not alone. Human survivors have been reported by my Hellguard. That seems unlikely. I am sworn to truth. You know this, right? And still Shred. comment on the army. If he clings to life, I would speak with them. Where were they seen? Far beyond this battlefield, horseman. I will find them. If the Third Kingdom is not yet extinguished, perhaps there is meaning to our battles beyond annihilation. Farewell, Death. You have your task, and I have mine. Yeah. It's the one. Um... So yeah, as I was saying, do have things on the list. Um, mainly just just three, because there's like three main things that it's like, oh yeah, this is this is important. Like one being Embracer Group trying to buy the world. Still, um, they they got Gearbox, Aspire, and Easy Brain. Easy Brain, I'm not really familiar. With. Um, but Aspire, yeah, I know that they've been doing. Uh, game boarding for many years. It's very possible that they've done more and I just can't think of it, but I mean, it's, there are plenty of good game ports out there that they... Um, but Gearbox, so the Borderlands franchise is now under Embracer Group. We just saw one place speculate that that could translate to seeing the IP used in other um, by other studios. I haven't. 
but my plan has kind of been, whenever I get to it, uh, that I'd first... I mean, basically, it would take a lot of time <laughs> for me, because my thinking was I would try to do plus play pluses in the previous two games, Worldlands uh, 1 and 2. I'm not touching the previous sequel again. Um, and then, because they don't have review playthroughs for those, and then do Borderlands 3. Which, except for the Season Pass 2 stuff, I have, I, I did get the, uh, the Complete Edition, Game of the Year Edition, whatever the hell it was they called it. why that is the... It's the only thing I can think of. It doesn't seem like it would be necessary. Yeah, I don't know about that whole... that suggestion that we might see... Um, I cannot. That we might see... Uh, additional games... Uh, additional borderline... Oh, no, I guess you do... Um, coming from other developers. I mean, it is possible, but I don't know. It is also the case, though, that it is, uh, Gearbox will maintain its own, it's basically another part of the Emb Embracer group. It's not like it's been acquired and is underneath a different company. It will, is on the same level as, uh, THQ Nordic, Deep Silver, Coffee Stain, Trying to remember what else. Because it's seven, the easy brain is eight for those. <laughs> uh, is handy games? Handy games might be. Um handy games is it might not be though, because it was like spun off from uh Teach Q Nordic. So it might not be its own uh group as well. But yeah, besides that, also, um, the introduction that the humans have set tracks. Um, there's also the, um, news that EA will be releasing in May. I don't remember when in May, I'm sorry about that. Um, Mass Effect Legendary Edition, which is the trilogy, uh, remastered. Not remade, remastered. Um, so, like, you know, updated graphics, updated textures, things like that. Um, but not a ground-up rebuild, because... And I guess it... I just didn't realize it, or I forgot that those are actually Unreal Engine 3 games? Um... Okay. So, no reason to come. Um... But, yeah, in order to try to bring that to uh, Unreal Engine 4, it, it, that's not true. Not even. Um, and I did see one place, I don't remember where, where somebody made the point that... Um, I... Okay. Um, Out. Yeah, that's what I thought. <gasps> I got an idea, I don't know. Um, but basically, the point being that, yeah, Unreal Engine 3 and 4 are so different that it would not be possible to um, to bring it over. 
easily. Because, like, you know, one, one simple example, and very accurate example. Oh, wait. Would just be this? No? Yeah, you can. What am I missing? I, what I want to do. Come on. Let me at least try. Um. Or maybe just go through here. Um, but Unreal Engine 3 used Kismet for a lot of scripting stuff. Unreal Engine 4 went to a different system, Blueprints, I believe they called, and it's like, yeah, there's no easy conversion there, so you can't just, like, import things from a UE3 game and suddenly have it working. Um, which means that they would have had to have completely rebuilt. There we go. Have you come seeking a slow dagger? <laughs> Give my regards to the dagger. <laughs> but would have required completely rebuilding all of the scripting and such for these rather complex RPG games in a new engine in order to achieve. So it's like, yeah, that, that, no. And that, that's completely reasonable. <laughs> in, in my opinion, that, that is completely reasonable to be like, yeah, we're not doing that. Because that, that's... Three games... I mean, true. 2K has, has done that with the um, original Mafia uh, Defendive Edition, the Mafia 1 Defendive Edition, but it's like, yeah, that's also one game... We're talking about three AAA games here. Um, very complex AAA games at that same level of building it from scratch would need to be. So. And I would not be surprised if it turns out that we get some sort of announcement, either another Mass Effect game or something akin to that. You know, where it's like this might be a testing the waters kind of situation. I could believe that. It's a lot of the remakes seem to be that. Don't they? And it's like that they're doing that to see how well the community uh, takes to the, takes to it. And if it if it's taken well, then it's okay. We, we'll we'll do something new. Because I mean, there would have been plenty of work that they needed to do, but it is still going to be easier to do. From my understanding, it would be easier to do the whole, you know, upgrading the the graphics and such, rebuilding some of the UI and such to make everything consistent. Would be easier to do that. Um, this is awkward. Shouldn't, shouldn't that be gone? Um, huh. I I have an idea. I don't I don't like it, but what will this work? Um, but this kind of work would be easier. Than like you know completely rebuilding a new E4 and potentially making an entirely new game. So just checking because that's gone. Okay, yeah, so that did work. I don't really know what that got me aside from the contents of that chest, but maybe it did something. Stupid like that, it might be something. Stupid. Nope, never mind. It is not something stupid like that where you have to like use the teleport dash. Yeah, and what the hell just happened? Uh. 
Um, but yeah, it's not something. Yeah, I, I'm... I'm not seeing it. Um, yeah, so, I mean, it would be kind of neat to see another Mass Effect game, I'll be honest, because I enjoyed 1 and 2. I've never played 3 or Andromeda. That, that was the name of it, right? Oh, this is where it's... Oh. Admit, I doubt I will ever play Andromeda. <laughs> because is, isn't that Origin only? And I tend not to, to do many games on Origin. I do have several there, I just, you know. Don't don't really do, do, do them. Yeah. I'm trying to remember how many games I may have there that also you know, I can actually see. Let me do that. I'll tab just in case. It's probably a bad idea, but just in case. Uh. Yeah. Is it just because of that? Hang on. There we go. Oh, I actually do have a number of games that are only on or that I only have an origin. I, I just pulled up GG Galaxy, so I can see all that stuff. How about ones that? Dead Space 3 I only have on it. And by mad, I mean like AAA games. Battlefield 3. That's basically it. Everything else is either like smaller games that I got because something gave them for free kind of thing. Um, or I also have the games on Steam. Like Dead Space 1 and 2. Mass Effect 2. Oh yeah, I also the Medal of Honor games. Allied Assault, Pacific Assault, Most Wanted. Those are original. Um. There we go. Okay, I so I have an idea here. Should work. I can't. That actually does not make sense. Because you're only able to access this at the very end of the main campaign, so it doesn't make sense that I don't have access to all the abilities that I have by the end of the game. I was going to use the Soul Splitter. In case you were wondering, and I screwed that up. Um, so, yeah, I... what was it? Is it 50 or 6 dollars, the Mass Effect Legendary Edition? I did see a hundred and twenty gig though. Yeah, I had a feeling that. Oh, wait, I know how to do that. I remember this. Um. Yeah, it's like a hundred and twenty. That that's I mean yeah, it is three games. But I would be, like, we on Steam. And I don't remember if I saw it was Steam or original. Um, but, like, on Steam, how some games work are, is, um... You can... Like, they're, they're separate DLC, so you can actually download them one at a time. Like, a Hitman 2 is like that. So is Hitman 1, where each location is its own DLC, so you can go in and turn them off. 
Um, so that way you don't have the full game installed all at the same time. It's like, that would be desirable to me. Um, but the other thing yeah, that I can talk about... I was actually considering doing that, but it's like, nah. Because of timing stuff, that wouldn't work so well. Um, the Ashes of, Ashes of the Singularity version 3.0 update is, came out this week. Um, and I keep forgetting you know, to mention, yeah, don't forget, I'm recording this Friday, and I have this come out on Saturday. Um, and until February 8th, the game is on sale at 55% off. Um, well, I decided to, and I do what I did last, uh, do what I mentioned I would do last week, which is do a Let's Play Plus in it, where I have been replaying the game, capturing that, and I actually put it, made it live, made it public. I still want to record one more video, which should be out before this goes live, but I haven't recorded it yet, so. Um, but have we done all of the campaign missions that I already did? I didn't realize I didn't do all of them, but I do remember I did. The, the last video I have that I want to do will be looking at uh, the skirmishes, you know, d doing the, um, you just, you know, you make a match and, you know, you have full access to everything. It's not tied to, to the story, it's just a skirmish. That's my my next uh, the next recording I want to do. It's just you know I haven't done it yet. But I made the videos live since hey the update's out now the game's on sale and stuck that in the uh, press release for if anyone wants to see somebody play it badly, um, but play it. There it is. And I might do some more in it outside the skirmishes. I don't know. It's just as I said, I'm not like bad. It's so I'm. I'm not very encouraged to keep playing in some of the campaign. I did all... I did nine... Nine parts at, um... Normal, but then the last one I had to set to beginner. Be uh, no, sorry, eight parts. Eight places normal, and then I had to do the last one on beginner, because it was just... Killing me. And part of it is there, there is some unfor uh, some unfortunate army management things in there that yeah, I remember that was there originally in the game. Um, still there. But also um, the game really does at least the campaign does kinda demand a aggressive playstyle, which is not how I want to play. That's not how I approach, so it's a problem. And that last level is basically, oh yeah, there's three different spots that you need to need to uh, defend, which means there's actually three spots that, well, two that you need to aggressively push to. You cannot succeed if you uh, don't push, because then the enemy just the AI is able to so efficiently manage itself that it will be. At least that was my experience. <gasps> but with a skirmish, because things should start more fairly. Um, wait, there's also a door over here. Okay, I'm gonna go this way first, because the bird went that way. Um, but yeah, so those, most of those, by the time this comes out, hopefully all the videos are out. It, it depends. Um, I'll have to do the record, that last recording of the skirmishes the end of the day today. So, yeah. I will hunt you down! You'll pay for what you've done! This is a mistake. I only wish to speak. Um. Yeah, but it is still my intent that the Let's Play Plus is a lot easier to get out because I just need to process the audio, the video I record at the bitrate I upload, so it's a lot easier to go through all that. So I should hopefully be able to have it come out have to go live tonight. Um, There's nothing left to lose. It's easier to keep your head. Most people panicked or tried to fight the demons. Can't blame them. They were slaughtered like cattle. But nothing they did mattered in the end. Um, but yeah, so I should be able to have it come out later today, and then it'll be part of the playlist. 
uh, how the playlist by the time this video comes out. I'm also just trying to think, do I have, is there anything else I have to mention? You see, the, the GPU, th was that, I don't remember, was, was the GPU thermal uh, article, was that out in time last week, or was that this, this week? Hang on just a second. Sorry, just got a phone call that I I don't know the number of. At least I don't think I recognize that number. Didn't didn't look know it. Okay. Okay. Um Yeah, in theory it because I have had this happen before, this is quite an aside. But, but in theory it's like, oh, maybe it's somebody. Oh, okay. I'll bet it's silent. Yep. Four seconds, most likely just silent. Meaning it is almost certainly... Um, almost certainly just spam. Uh, but it's like, in theory, it could also be, you know, if I don't know the number, like a place I've applied for a job at, calling to, like, set up an interview or something. Um, which I've had to happen before, where they just, like, cold call, and it's like, no, don't, don't do that. Do you have any idea? I mean, it's like... It doesn't seem weird to me to see that as being very disrespectful. That's like, if you just, you know, call without, you know, any warrant, without, like, trying to schedule that, oh, would now be a good time? And it's like, you have my email address. Contact me that way to let me know that you're like, oh, we'd like to talk to you at this time about scheduling an interview, or try to schedule it over email, whatever you want, but contact me. Because it's like, in theory, you're... I mean, yeah, I, I don't, but it's like, in theory, you've got people applying for the job that already have jobs that are working, and you're calling them in the middle of work. That's, that's kind of, you know, a, a red flag of you don't actually, you know, respect my time because you're trying to take it, like. Um, the one time I, I do very much remember that happening, though, the guy after after calling, did leave an e did, did email me, so I did end up, uh, was still able to do that, but it's like, send the email first. Make sure I am free to talk at that time. Oh, so, should be able to do that. Um, and then, you know, then call. It's like, to me, I see it as just courtesy. Yeah, n nothing down here, but it's still, I wanted to destroy everything. Um. I'm also just trying to think of the same thing to, to mention. Oh yeah, the Steam Game Festival is... I am barely aware of that, by the way. Um, and by that I mean I have, uh... I don't even remember exactly. Um, by that I mean, it's like, yeah, it's going on, but I've not really looked at it. I've been doing other things with my Wii. Um, even though it's, like, half of the things that I had in the, the, uh, video game news roundup were basically just, um, what were uh, included. There we go. Now I finally found the appropriate word to use. Included. Um... Oh, and now there's a demo up as part of this, and it only goes until February 9th. Um, by, by the way, I just want to mention for this puzzle, I knew it had to go in this one because it was, the, the thing was near the other one. So it's like, yes, the, it's a video game. They, 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 in video games, it's like, it always has to go the greater of just... Um, yeah, so it's like... One of them 
kind of neat looking. Uh, and I, I did consider, you know, maybe do one of those, but it's like, well, which one? And it's like, I'm near the end of this. Let me finish this off, and then I need to figure out what game I want to keep doing after this. And I know I had an idea what game to use this afterwards. I just don't remember what it is. Um, I might have actually marked it. Because I keep a Steam group, Steam category of uh, the games we're streaming. But it's also I know that, like, that one of them, I still have Override 2 in there, even though I haven't the game for, well, since I did that one recording end of last year. Sorry about that. Um... And you know what part of the challenge is, is to figure out what game I'd be comfortable doing once a month. Which does kind of limit it to games I've already played. <laughs> but even then, it's like, I I would not want to do Dark Souls 3 that way. I'm, I'm definitely not going to do that. Because <laughs> that, that will beat me up very hard. Because that, that, that is a game that I do remember finding it difficult, but eventually, like, getting the timing down so it wasn't so bad. Playing once a week, I would not, I, I'd never be able to get the timing. Oh, that's right, that's what I was distracted by the phone call, but the, um, uh, and now my mind turned off again. The GPU thermal off. Which, yeah, I'm glad to see that. Because uh, that means that all three of those thermal articles are out. I had no idea how well they're going to do, how interesting they might be to anyone, but... Still, you know, I, I like that... I thought that it was interesting work that I did and wanted to share it. Plus, then I, you know, whenever... I do get around to because I do. I, I'm right now hopeful I'll be able to get like a 6700 XT GPU whenever AMD gets around to announcing those. Even um, end of March, I think, is what the current rumor is suggesting. Um, But uh, if I do manage to get one, I'll probably run it through what the the scripts and you know, just see see what that comes up with. That would have to be a very powerful sniper right Alright, um... Let me also quickly... Okay, I am full on health. Had a feeling that's what it would be, but still wanted to... Wanted to be certain. Um... No, don't want to fall down. But yeah, so I'm, I might end up doing that, something like that, and if I ever get a new uh, CPU cooler on the test system, I'll definitely run that, run it through the CPU script. You know, even though I have no idea when I might use these scripts again, I'm still glad I have them and may be able to put them to use sometime. And also the CPU scripts I put up on GitHub, so anyone. Since aside from get it over with, then. Be human. The no 3D Mark time. Professional Edition, all of it is like free or open right. source software. We'll see about or that. Or open. You're no demon. I can tell that much. 
If you don't want to kill me, why chase me across the whole damn city? I thought your kind was no more. Who or what are you? I am death. Death is the one thing that's eluded me. Why, after all this, do you come for me now? Oh, looks like I have this fight to do now. After this, I'll save and stop. Ow. Because he needs to be stronger. didn't know better, I'd say they were angels. Doesn't matter. Neither cares much for our kind. You. You're different somehow. You would think less of me had I come at any other time. Yeah. Could it be that humans still live? I would hardly call this living. Yeah, my body works just fine. But everything that I live for is gone. Still, you should be dead. I stay low. There are ways of avoiding the demons. They're not all powerful as they would have us believe. Is it us? There are others. Uh, not sure. But I work alone. Some things never change, I guess. Even after the apocalypse. What became of those humans? I don't know. I can only hope that their end was quick. That's most likely. 
I respect your need for secrecy, human, but I must know, how did you survive? I was a Boy Scout. A what? Never mind. A demon lord caught up with me a while back. We made a deal. I sold my soul. I see. And what else did you give up? Forced me to tell him the hiding place of the other survivors. What was this demon's name? He called himself Belial. Wait, what are you gonna do? Kill him. First, he will tell me what happened to the other humans. Kill him? You're out of your mind! Those things that attacked us on the street, they were nothing. Belial's a demon lord! I've slain many lords in my time. Whatever you say. Oh yeah, and if you see my soul lying around, mind fetching it for me? Might as well grab this before saving and stopping. Oh, isn't that nice of Volk? Well, I don't have it like. I do kind of wonder if, if we're going to see a Darksiders 4 and when that might remember how well Darksiders 3 did. Like, what, what, did that do well enough to warrant a, another one? I mean, I would hope so, because it really was a... It, yeah, there were some things about that I didn't like. Definitely not frustrated at times, but it was still a pretty good game. Um, And the whole series is, is, is quite interesting. Quite engaging. Anyway, um... Yeah, I got nothing else coming to mind, so I guess I'll just stop here. 40 minutes into the... Uh, Demon Lord Belial, or whatever the name of this DLC is. I don't remember, but I, I remember Demon Lord Belial and what the story is. He's an interesting one. Um, and once I do that, then I can be back in uh, the main campaign, finish that off, and then I'll be figuring out what game I do after this. And I got really quiet there. Right? Sorry about that. Uh, just sort of trailed off. Alright. Gonna stop, and shall see you next time.